sneak in, and I'll get the coach. You can try the house. Or wait until morning when I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show. While you sneak into the house, find what you can, and then get the stagecoach. What do you think? Let's wait. Okay. <laughs> Let's get on with this, Mr. Uh, Morgan. Yes. <clears throat> Let me head up there and make a fool of myself. <laughs> with pleasure. Just don't get caught. Because it's me, they'll shoot first. <clears throat> Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. Get him down here. Get lost, mister. I was lost for many years. I was lost many years. Now I'm not. And you know what? Oh, <laughs> here he is. Are you the father of the house? Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I was just chatting with Junior here a bit. You selling something, partner? I'm not selling, sir. I'm giving it away. <laughs> I was just telling uh, uh, Junior, what's your name, son? Robert Crawford III, sir. Good. Oh, pleasure to meet you. Both of you, sir. My name... My name... Now, don't tell no one, because in New York, I'm kind of famous. I once performed on Broadway. Now, that's not important or relevant. I have been saved! I've been found! Oh, no, I, I saw it in your eyes. You think I'm a nut? Do you think I'm a nut for Robert the Third? I ain't interested in no religious talk. I'm not a religious man. Respects them as hazard. I got something better. Way better than church.
You done, Arthur? Yep. Covered my tracks so well, they won't even know I was in there. Good work. Let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. Here. We need to get out of here. Damn it! Must have spotted us riding out. Uh, I guess I should have tried leaving the back way. Too late now. So what were you able to lift from the house? A few bits and pieces. Nothing too fancy. Well, we need anything we can get right now. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. <laughs> it wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye. And as usual, he did not flinch. Yeah, exactly. How long you think we're gonna stick around here for? Not sure. Till we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting to get back on our feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. Show it up. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. 